on these places. This place is just full of amazing plants and amazing things to see. This is something unusual and it's very beautiful. I really love all their stuff. Hmm. This looks pretty. So I don't know what type of station is this for them. Maybe baby plants. They have all this cool, beautiful. Oh, they keep water here, so it's more humid for them. Wonder. This is a new one. Dollars for a jungle. Mm -hmm. a pretty good shape. That's an Ontarian that I don't have. That looks really pretty. So, here they have the white twisters. I love the millions. This one, I've never seen the striped one. 39. That's a very nice variegation. Okay. This one is seventeen dollars. It's very nice. Cheap. And that's called the silver leaf London jar. It's actually very nice. Looks very nice. Okay, what is this? Can you tell us? So this is product of Canada, but it doesn't say what it is. It's very beautiful too. So their white wizards are like 36 bucks, 39.40. So white wizard. What is this one? This is a pink princess. Yeah. And these are wizards. What this one? The white wizard, very nice variation actually. So this is probably baby tropicals for them. They have very nice ones. What is this one? Let's see. I know it's a blonde and drawn for sure. Just don't know which one. Doesn't say that. But these are baby plants they have, so everyone can find whatever they like. Some people like baby plants more than big plants and here's the fair plant station for them. And people have just enjoying their time. So here are their begonias. They have beautiful begonias here. I saw a couple I really liked. Oh and here is the Moon Valley friendship plant. I don't know what plant is this. What plant is this? What is this? Let me see. Probably begonia. Yeah, it's a watermelon begonia. And here are all the common plants. This is very beautiful and huge as well. I really like all these sensibilities. I wanted this one. I don't really wanted this one, but I feel like it's not in the best shape. Not expensive, $70. This is not expensive. So they have there a bunch of sensibilities. And here's a bunch of ferns. They have. And this is something my mom used to grow. So this brought childhood memories to me. <laughs> they have beautiful ferns. I actually like how they look. And then here's a famous one that everyone likes to mount on the wall. So this is the Neverland one. Yeah, so you uh, mount this on your walls. I like this one, it's very pretty too. And here are a bunch of begonias again, more ferns. So this fern is actually very pretty, I just don't know how to take care of it, but it's very, very pretty. And then here are the begonias, smaller versions of probably what's outside. I really love their selections. And I 
like this one and this one is there Begonia Makolata and I have this one I have this one at home there's a bunch of other ones I would really was thinking to get this one but it doesn't have too many healthy leaves so I don't I'm looking for a healthier plant and I also like this one on the back and this is the, the name. This is the Begonia Imperials. And this one is the Begonia Rizomans. I actually just noticed how beautiful this pattern is, too. So here is more Begonias. And some money plant. Here is a day plant, the Doronias, a very large, large monster, but I forgot the name of this plant. So I guess it's a prayer plant though. Looks like one of my plants. And this is the Maromatis something. I'm not sure, is this a foil? Probably not, but it's nice. So that's like foils. And here we have the violets. And this is another plant I cannot pronounce right here. Here are some more plants. More lilies. Here are some of the um, Lord of Fly, kind of horse plant. Small one. Here's an aquarium with a bunch of plants. Really? Oh, this begonia. What begonia is this? Has? Tattoo. Hockey tattoo. Begonia. This is pretty. Two and then. I think this is also predator plant. Picture plant. Yeah. Those are really good. Oh, he has a baby plant right there. And more of the plants. So, this is also a picture plant. You can see here also there the London drone. Squamiferum. I was thinking to actually get it, but I'm ready. I found the plant I wanted at home and I'm gonna stick to that plant. Some orchards, rubber trees, money trees, again some civilians, bromelias, more plants. Here's a bird of paradise. And here are all the sun severes, I guess. They have large ones, small ones. They have the very beautiful There's more of the plants. And this is jungle fever. This is the jungle of the London drones. They have a whole bunch like black cardinal, like um, Naro and a whole other bunch of them all together. Very pretty. This is and this is the gold, golden violin. Hmm. That's interesting. They have imperial gold, jungle fever, more imperial gold. Very beautiful plants. Very beautiful plants. Words. This is the old golden violin. Yeah. 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 Um, I wonder what is this one. This is Taka and Tiere Black. I don't know this one. They're large, large 
ones as well. And this is the Macero thingy with the tapartita. theme of this nursery is beautiful. We <laughs> have bromeliads, different colors. This is like, I really like bromeliads, like, so pretty. And then here's the red and the orange one. More so superiors and gaves. Very pretty. And that's the things of orange in a huge, huge form. More bromeliads. This is, I think it's a ginger plant. Here is the more amphidiums. I really like this amphidium. I have no idea. Let's see some thorium. What is this on them also? Some type of something. I don't know. It really talks. Appeals to me. It's very bushy. And I would like to have one. Not expensive too, it's fourteen dollars. But I don't think it says what type it is. No it doesn't, but it just says it's fourteen dollars. Here are some more tools. So on this side they have Holocaustions, different type of holocaustions. I have this in big sizes. Oh, I really like. Oh my god, this is a dragon. I'm sure it's a dragon. This is the Raffinron, yes, dragon. This is a dragon plant. Very healthy. And it's very large. I actually like how large it is. I already have one. But if I didn't, that would be the one I would get. And here is more and more Melanocrisis. This is the Melanocrisum. I find it very cheap actually. The Melanocrisum here is like $14. I really like it. I'm thinking to get one. And they have here just Mastara and Donsoni. A whole bunch of other plants, white knight, silver swords, very, very mm -hmm. pretty, pretty plants. So when you walk from this place, it's like amazing. Look at this huge, huge prayers plant. It's so pretty. And I was telling my husband I would get it if I wasn't known for killing a couple of them. I want to pay for something I can kill. And here are the prayer spirits. They have a whole theme here, very nice rubber trees. And of course, I have to say, mine was $12 and it's larger, and theirs is $179. So I feel pretty good about it. I feel pretty good that I made a good deal for my clothes. Here's more. Oh. Some bamboo, I didn't see. This looks interesting. I didn't see this plant. It looks very interesting. What plant is this? This is a red yellow plant. Oh, I need to show it to my husband. I need to show it to my husband because he was like, saying, Oh, is that a thing? And I have a lot of pottery here. So I just want to show you something I saw very cool. This is this bromeliad. I hope we can focus. But there is water, there are plants inside, and it's like its own world. I don't know how to do it. Oh, I just got... Oh, I cannot. It's very beautiful. So the beauty of this place is like really amazing. They made it very pretty. This is a huge, huge hall. It's very, very beautiful and very, very big. This place just screams unique and beautiful and amazing and everything is so, so cute in here. And I talked to these beautiful birds earlier. They are so cute. So 
So this is the part that I really enjoy seeing, mostly because of this huge cacti. I like it's huge. So pretty. Oh my god. Like there's no end. And I was fighting these in, on my cacti. And they keep coming back, so I have no idea what they are, but I see this one can survive with them, so I'm gonna just leave them alone. This cactus's name is Yoko. It's just a beautiful, amazing cactus. And they have these beautiful birdies here. Hi! Here are more lawyers. There's a bird. This is a combo. Oh, look at this aloe plant. This is one huge aloe plant. <laughs> yeah, the springs. I don't really, I'm not really excited to get because they died readily for me. And here's more of the cocktail. Very big ones. Like, as compared to my hand. Some variegated cactuses. I wonder how much is a variegated cactus? $59. And here are more. More. Very beautiful. Like, it's like a really amazing place to actually come and just enjoy your day. And they have these baby plants. This is something we see more regular at the stores. Oh my gosh, I just thought this was a cactus and it's just some type of garden, whatever. <laughs> so funny. So, monkey tail. Oh, those are so cute. Monkey tail. And here are the different types of other cactuses and succulents. And I hope I don't see anything in bloom because I would really like to take this guy home <laughs> but if I see something in huge bloom I will definitely take it very pretty here's another prickly cacti with flowers on more cacti wow this is actually pretty who is this? I gave this is Karas Tribes so beautiful, very beautiful, variegated aloe. Interesting, it's not that expensive. I looked online and they were a lot more expensive. And here I'm getting the plant. So, and here is something else. It has these beautiful flowers, and this is the Oscolaria pink ice plant. Oh, very large. They're pretty. This looks so good too. And I just want to show you this so This is so interesting. I would think that it actually died because it was so brown. I would get rid of it. But look, it has new green growth and they're still keeping it. And this is amazing too. Fancy tree. I would call it coral tree. Yeah, <laughs> this yeah. looks amazing. The colors are like really pretty. More taller. This is more jade plants. Did you guys knew that this can bloom? Oh, well, it's not in bloom yet. Or maybe it was in bloom already. But this, I think this is a prickly cactus, right? I think this is called like something like prickly cactus. It's very beautiful. And this is another pretty one. Very big. And look at this prickly here cactus. Very beautiful. Look at this. Succulents. And it's all too pretty. This is really beautiful to walk through, like it's full of joy. You can see all this colorful. Look at this one. It always amazed me 
how we have oh, <laughs> how we have these beautiful imprints like this is just beautiful beautiful plant and the cactuses all the aloe succulents oh look they have here this cactus isn't this the i believe this is the um no this is something else but i thought uh this is like the um, um dragon fruit cactus it's very pretty everything is pretty here all the succulents oh man and this one flowers so pretty i saw it in the video it really flowers pretty and these are the famous cactuses you can find in the desert oh look this one had at one point they had flowers and they had a bunch of them i guess but they look so nice this one still have small plants and small flowers blooms oh look at this this is art wow this is actually looking <coughs> excuse me very pretty and whatever this plant is is very fuzzy very beautiful succulents very colorful this is some type of palm and i don't know what plant is that it's a oh it says anisonathus anisonathus big red and this is what comes out from that plant very fuzzy eh? yeah, it's interesting and just it's just two more lawyers so these are the cactus succulents it's huge they have a huge huge um, collection of this looks very pretty i've never seen one of these this is like a tree and that's gold oh i cannot say that and i cannot put my hand in there because it's too prickly but i would like to know what point is that so maybe you guys can read through but it's really really it's an interesting plant i'll tell you that such an amazing plant and it's this area is for salt plants and look at this cacti this is called the orchid cactus and it's really really pretty like like I really want to have a piece of it or I want to buy it now because it looks just too beautiful this is just too beautiful and it has oh it's not focusing and it has a lot of blooms it looks very very beautiful and these are the foyers larger foyers and I think this is for it too wow this cactus goes all the way down and here's another one and look at this humongous humongous beautiful jade tree this is too beautiful you also can see a lines of plants different types but of course i'm interested in house plants and look at this humongous um, and then you can, here. Oh, you can browse from here probably a whole day and still not see all the beauty this is just too pretty and they literally have any plant you would like to see like there are many plants I haven't seen before look at this look how beautiful these are huge absolutely Huge. Very beautiful. I wonder how much does it cost? But it doesn't say price tag here. Very beautiful. And the pen is just totally amazing. 
look at the beauty the gorgeous. And the beauty of this place, of course, is unbelievable. Like, they have plants for everyone and everyone. And they have beautiful arrangements and all these statement pieces here. And look, they have here birds of paradise. And so, beautiful, beautiful. Oh, this bird of paradise is actually very big and pretty. But I'm looking for longer leaves that have larger leaves. You can see it's pretty chilly outside and they have elephant ears outside. Okay, interesting. And they have the palms. This is a nice palm actually. It looks very pretty.